did not complete the sweep against the, the Orioles, but they rebounded with a huge win today, as you can see. So let's get into these highlights, because, spoiler alert, there's a lot of them. Davis called up today, making his Major League debut, drafted number one overall as a catcher, 23-year-old, out in right field. A bit of a surprise, of course, when he was drafted as a catcher, but the Pirates won his bat in there, and they think he could make a difference. Osvaldo Vito makes his second Major League start, so some new faces for the Pirates here this week. Flared out towards right center, that one falling, falls for a hit, and Tuckman on pitch number six of the at-bat, dunks one into the outfield, and the leadoff man is on base. Out toward the notch. Joe finds it for the first out. The batter is Seiya Suzuki. Has a lot of sink on that fastball there. Little ride to it, up and in, striking on Suzuki. Suzuki is out number two, and the batter, Ian Hamp. You got him. And a couple of strikeouts for Osvaldo Vito. Veteran left-hander Drew Smiley for the 15th time. Pirates got him for three in the first in his last start. And McCutcheon draws the walk as he's done so well. He's aboard for Reynolds. Reynolds out there in center. And they got the runner picked off. Throw down to second. Tag out at second. Good job by Bellinger and a nice job by Horner to corral that throw and put the tag on him. Fly ball right field, Morrell back. Christopher with that bright red glove hauls it in. And a four pitch walk. And they're loaded. And a chance for Mike Tuckman. And a 3 1. Swing and a line drive. Base hit into center field. In to score Morrell. Gomes is on his heels. Mike Tuckman two for two. And he knocks in the first two runs of the game. And the Cubs have the lead. Well, last time it was a little bloop single for Tuckman. This time. Nothing soft about this 105 miles per hour off the bat three and one doesn't overswing just plays a little pepper with Brian Reynolds out there in center field and plates two. And now it's Nico Horner who flied to left his first time. Swing and a line drive and a base hit up the middle. Around third and in to score is Matt Stravoni. Tuckman into third an RBI single for Nico Horner and it is three nothing. Fourth hit of the inning, fifth of the game for the Cubs, all singles. It's been a lot of solid work here for the Cub hitters. Doesn't hit it all that hard, but able to, you know, with that good, quick, short stroke, strong enough to deliver a line drive to center. Bottom of the third inning, 3 nothing Cubs, and Henry Davis will be coming to the plate for the first time in his major league career. Full count on Henry Davis in his first plate appearance. Hard ground ball, fair. Heading to second. Henry's got a double. Welcome to the big leagues. And he unseats the cutlass right away. Uh, it's so great. It's so great right out of the gate. But boy, uh, it, it, the reports are he's got power, he's got bat speed, and he can hit a fastball. And there's a fastball up middle. Right over the third base the bag. Right Did not have to wait long for his first major league hit. Back to back walks. And they're loaded for Connor Joe. Line to left. That's hard contact, but right at half. The Pirates leave them loaded. And Nico Horner will stand in. Wow. And a strikeout. How about that swing? Yeah, that ball, uh, maybe he didn't see it or whatever, but that ball took off and he just loses it. And that'll bring up Seiya Suzuki. Another strikeout for Beto is sixth. Three strikeouts in a row for Osvaldo Beto. Ian Happ at the plate. And the Pirates have found somebody in Osvaldo Beto. That's up high, ball four. So once again, the bases are loaded for Pittsburgh. Now the cleanup man, Carlos Santana, due up. Popped up right side. 
And he's going to get out of it. Bellinger makes the grab. Madrigal is going to pinch it for Miles Mastroboni. Line drive and a base hit out into center field. The Cubs have the leadoff man on here in the seventh inning. And now it's Talkman, two for three. Madrigal on the go, pitches a strike, throw to second, and Nick has a stolen base. They've had a hard time shutting down the running game. Line drive, softly hit, base hit into left field. Willie Harris is going to send Madrigal. Throw to the play, tag, save! Madrigal just got his hand in there, and Tuckman with three hits and three runs batted in. Boy, aggressive send there by uh, by Willie with nobody out, but it pays off as Madrigal just able to beat that throw. If this throw is a little lower, they might get him. Just a little floater. Ian Happ intentionally walked, puts runners at the corners. Rather face Dansby Swanson. Tap softly to third. Hayes on the backhand. Throw across. Safe at first. Run is in to score. And it's 5 0. Dansby Swanson with an infield RBI single. And yeah, the Cubs add on. Good effort here by uh, Hayes. Wasn't able to get a very good handle on this ball. Threw a little bit of a change up over their first base. It's an infield hit. It's first and second. Mike Tuckman batting. On the ground to the right side. Bay throws it away. Gomes around and in to score. Madrigal will stop at third. And the Cubs add on. It is 6 0. Cubs will take it. Sloppy, sloppy work here for the Pirates in the eighth. Walk hit batter now miscued the throw by Bay. Well off the mark. Here's Nico Horner stepping in. On the ground, softly hit. Bay will pick it up. Throw to first. Run comes in to score. Nico knocks in another. And the Cubs lead it seven to nothing. And now it's Seiya Suzuki. Suzuki hits it hard, fair ball down the line. And here comes Tuckman around third, Suzuki into second. And Seiya an RBI double, and the Cubs enjoying themselves here in game one in Pittsburgh. It is eight nothing. And this time he finds a little hole there as he goes right down the line. Has to keep Ryan Hayes. So again, more hard contact on the ground for Suzuki, but fortunately this time for him, he gets a positive result. With two outs in the ninth, Zawinski pinch hitting for McCutcheon. Outside corner, ball game. Cubs win. And the Cubs continue to dominate the Pirates. Eight nothing the final. Cubs have put a beat down on the Pirates. Cubs have now won eight out of ten. Why is it always Old Spice? So, let's see. Hope to see you tomorrow. And I can show you a little bit about things. So, they, uh, some of the transformations I actually like. They're actually pretty clever. Because there's one that you turn into a Cerberus. <laughs> and one in the original, too. And then and there's a couple... There's another one where you, you get turned into a Cerberus. As well, in that, because there's only, there was like, not, like, the, uh, there's two beasts, furries, and they wanted to assimilate you, and when they ass assimilate you, and when they do that, I mean, they take your b body so they can evolve their body. Or if they want, they don't want to, they can turn you into one of them. They, they have two options. And they wanted to ass assimilate you, so uh, both of them did. So uh, and that didn't work because there's one of you and two of them. And they, uh, you end up, they end up fusing to you, so they can evolve their bodies together with yours. And I'm going a little off topic, but I uh, hope that one's in special edition. Uh, go to like a uh, see you tomorrow for another Cubs highlight video. Peace out.